Good morning guys. Another day up here at the off-grid cabin. So today is going to be a day to take down some more dead trees and get some logs hauled down to the stack that I'm preparing to mill. So I'm going to go down, find more dead trees and cut them down. Slightly colder today. It's minus two right now, but that makes it a little easier to get around on the snow because it's frozen. I got my two assistants with me, ready to go. The new panels are bringing in lots more power. You ready to go, Odin? All right, let's head down there. Good girl. I just got this one last tree. I'm going to try and I want I've been following them this way. But I don't want to take out a bunch of this other tree's branches up top. So I'm going to drop this one right straight across there.
should have used my bigger bar on that one. I couldn't cut all the way through from I had to go from each side. I got that big tree cut up. I've got this 13 foot by 18 inch log. And I got 10 footer here. It's uh, 11 inches. And then I cut a bunch of the rest up into firewood already. Still gotta cut that remaining section into firewood. This is what I've got stacked so far. It's a good start on next year's firewood. Now I'm just going to load these two logs on the sled and haul them down and then I'm going to come up and finish cutting up this into firewood and cleaning up all the branches and then we'll see what other trees I'm going to take down. The dogs are getting bored.
Well guys, I just got stuck on the last load of logs. The snow's melted so much. It was uh, really slushy. There's one uphill section right before where I dumped the logs and as soon as I hit it, the sled sunk and the logs were dragging in the snow and I just came to a stop and could have got going again. So I had to kick them off the sled and just leave them where they were. They're about 200 feet short of where I wanted them to be, but I'll head down tomorrow morning once everything's frozen and load them back on the sled and see if I can pull them up the little bit of the hill. So I've loaded everything up here. And I guess I'm done for the afternoon. This is what it looks like with the five trees down. This one looks like it's dying. It's still alive up there, but it doesn't look too great. Now at least it's opened it up a bit so the more sun gets in. There's a few small spruce growing in here like that. So at least some more sun will get in here. This is what I've got for firewood so far out of these trees. Alright, so that does it for this video. See you guys on the next one.